What's up, Jazz Nation? Your girl is back with another mother freaking video for the ass, okay? Oh, God, okay, I was about to say, what is that? It's been a minute. I think it's like been a week since I've been posting. Let me tell y'all something. I need a new camera. So right now I'm chopping off this camera and the flip part about to come off. So it's like all bad. I'm struggling right now. I was gonna post when I got a new camera, but I just said forget it. It's gonna be too long and I want y'all to, you know, unsubscribe because, you know, your girl is not being active on her channel. That's what I'm doing. But look at me though. I'm just like, look at my bun just all over the place. Like I need to get myself and my life together. But today is my little cousin's birthday party. And we're supposed to be going to the bounce house today. My twin is not coming with me. I want her to come with me because you know, I don't really talk to a lot of people. You know, I only talk to like maybe my cousin that's gonna be there. Um, that's, you know, my little cousin's mom. So I'm probably gonna, you know, kick it with her, but I wanted my twin to go. That way, you know, y'all could see her and all that other stuff. But if you she didn't wanna come because she wanna be born and just stay here on a good day, oh well, that's her. But me and Lele about to be out, we about to go. And Lele is in the room, and oh my God, look at my bun. Lele is in the room right now. Um, she's got done eating. I need to get her dressed. I actually need to get myself together too because the party started at 5.30. And it's like freaking four something, so. You look good, can I show them you right now? You look good. Can I show you? She's so irritating, y'all. She's the mean one. That's how that's how y'all know like the difference between me and her. Like she's the mean one. I'm gonna show y'all Lele. Come on. I ain't gonna show you. Dang. She's so irritating. <laughs> what she was doing? <laughs> what was you doing, Elena? Because you look like you've been doing something. What you doing? Why look you trying to sit up? Y'all, she make that face every time she trying to sit up. What is this? What is this? This slob? You been slobbing? You been slobbing? Hmm? The boop, boop, boop. Boop, 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 boop. Fat mama. Y'all, this is the outfit she gonna be wearing today. This cute shirt with these pants. She gonna be wearing this today. I was gonna buy her outfit, but I just said forget it because I wanna buy her outfit for Easter. So, she's wearing a little outfit that I bought like a month ago. So, hi! Hi, fatty. Hi, fatty. She is so cute. I love my baby. I love you. I love you. So, y'all, it's 4 11 right now. As y'all can see, it's 4 11. Oh, well, 4 12 right now. So, I'm about to get you ready first. Because look at this. You got milk stains on you. You got milk stains on you. That's not cute. That's not cute, fat mama. That's not cute, fat mama. No, no, no. You ready to have fun? Hmm? You ready to jump around with mommy? Because you can't jump by yourself, but you could jump with mommy. You ready? Hmm? <laughs> you ready? Hmm? Okay. So I'm about to get her dressed, and y'all gonna see her in a minute. So. Look at little Miss Lele. Hey, Buckaboo. This is her little fit, y'all, but I'm going to show it when we get inside. But we on our way there. There go, Nene. <laughs> she want to show her face. Mom's right here. Okay. Look at Boo-Boo. Yeah. We are on our way there. I'm kind of excited. I haven't seen my uh, little cousin in so long, and that's my baby. Like, I don't care how old she get. That is my baby. Y'all going to see her. And, you know, she's trying to make herself a little YouTube channel, too. So, this is going to be so funny. I'm going to get her the camera. She's going to introduce herself to y'all. So we about to get there. And this is gonna be my first time going to this bounce house. I'm excited. Like I don't care how old you is, you gonna always wanna do something fun. So I'm a little childish, so I don't care. I like to have fun, but we about to go ahead. And I might give y'all some roll footage. I might not, but y'all gonna be with me. Okay, so let's go. Oh look, Auntie. Hey. Ready? Okay, Jazz Nation. So it's like really bright out here. Um, but let me turn this way. We are here at the bounce house that y'all can see right there. Let me see, right here. So we're here and we about to go in. I need to get my baby. I need to get my baby, okay? We about to have some fun. Even though Lele can't jump around or whatever. Even though she can't jump around or whatever. Y'all know. We still gonna have fun, but we're here y'all. It's dark. My sis, mommy here. About to go in here. Lele right here. Look at her, irritating. Hey. 
I'm dead. Irritating. Run. Oh, it's full in here. Hi. Woo. <laughs> so we got a sign in. You ready to have some fun? Janae? Jump around a little bit. You gonna jump around? <laughs> <laughs> we about to be knocking kids over today. Say good. We about to be knocking kids over. It's raps. They lay heavy as hey. <laughs> it is packed in here though. It's like a whole bunch of little kids. It's cool though. What is this? Who are, who are these characters? <laughs>
my bun. Y'all really need to get my hair done. I did not close out the vlog because I was just so tired. Like, I literally went to bed as soon as I got home. And, you know, I just didn't feel like, you know, ending off the vlog, to be honest with y'all. Like, I was just so tired. Like, them kids can wear you out, like, for real. So, yeah, yesterday I had, I put on my Instagram basically telling you guys, ask some questions because, you know, I'm going to be doing a Q&A. So... Here it is. I know y'all been waiting. Like, so where's the Q&A yet? I had to put it at the end. Okay. Because I wanted to vlog my little cousin's birthday. So I just said, why not, you know, um, combine it instead of just making it two separate videos. Because I have another video that I'm doing. So I'm about to just shout them out. So this person asked, how old are you? And this is Sally Anderson 93 Shout out to you. Uh, She asked, how old am I? And I am 20. One. I don't look like I'm 21, but I am 21. Black don't crack, so <laughs> I'm gonna be 83 looking like I'm 21, okay? <laughs> the second question somebody asked was, his name is Robert Dolo. Robert Dolo. How's being a mom? Is that Robert or Roberto? Uh, I think that's Roberto. Roberto Dolo. Sorry. <laughs> Roberto Dolo. Um, asked, how's being a mom? Being a mom is... Uh, freaking amazing I love it um it can get a little exhausting sometimes but overall I love being a mom Andrea 94 awesomeness how many months is Elena Elena is four months she'll be five months on the 26th of this month so yeah I'm just it's just getting close to the day you know where Lele can start eating cereal and like little mashed potatoes like I can't wait yeah oh yeah I can't wait till our teeth come in. That way we can eat chicken nuggets together. I love chicken nuggets. This is by Chloe. What do you think can keep a lasting relationship? The things that I think... What I think that can keep a relationship lasting is... I would say... Forgiveness and communication. Yeah. I would say forgiveness. I would say forgiveness and communication would definitely, you know keep a relationship going you know because you got to communicate um work through your problems if it's you know something that you can work out if it is you know something that you guys can work out and work it out that's where communication comes in and forgiveness that's you know depending on the situation you know it could be a tough pill to swallow to forgive somebody but i mean at the end of the day you got people that been together for like 40 years 50 years, 80 years, you know? So I, I think forgiveness and communication is can definitely keep a relationship going. This one is by India Wyatt. Are you happy? Um, I won't necessarily say I'm happy. Me, I won't necessarily say I'm happy. Look at my bun, this is an issue. This is an issue. I won't necessarily say I'm happy. I am, I'm good. I won't be, ha this is tripping me out. <laughs> I won't be happy y'all I will not be happy until I am where I want to be in life that's when I will be happy like where I ain't gotta worry about nothing I ain't gotta worry about no bills I, ain't, I just don't have to worry about nothing I'm living life carefree just doing me I'm going to be happy making sure my daughter is good making sure she got what she need making sure she don't have to worry about nothing I will be happy with life I need a lot of money I'd be happy with life, okay? Like, period. When I live out my dream, I'm gonna be happy. Right now, I'm just maintaining. I'm just living. And, yeah. Can can being a full-time mom become stressful? And this is by Brittany Lanasia. That's cute. Um, Brittany Lanasia. <laughs> that is so cute to me, though. But kind of sound weird, Brittany Lanasia, but it's so cute. Okay, so, um, can becoming a full-time mom you know become stressful yes it can it can become stressful it could become exhausting but you know the support system that i have it kind of takes that weight off of it um i'm happy that i got the support system that i have because you know it's they're a big help um so sometimes you know but it's all about the support system that you have so are you talking to anybody Devin? what's up with these last names y'all Devin, Devin. i'm just gonna say Devin d because i can't pronounce that and i don't want to say it wrong so Devin d he asks are you talking to anybody um on a dating level no i don't are you ready to date again if so what would you do differently to keep the relationship solid 
Hmm. No, I'm not ready to date again. If so, what would you do differently? Okay, so no, I'm not ready to date again. What I would do differently that I didn't do in my last relationship that I would do in my next relationship to make it last longer would be a change behavior. That's what I would do. Other than that, I'm a very good girlfriend to have, a good wife. You know what I'm saying? I hold it down. You know, I hold it down for my man so he won't have to worry about that, okay? I'm not ready to get in a relationship because there's some things that I need to, you know, improve on to better myself, you know. Um, other than that, that's it. I think I need to step up my drip a little bit more, but don't worry about that because the drip is coming. So I need to step up my drip a little more and that's really about it. <laughs> that's really about it to be honest with y'all i feel like anybody could come to me and talk to me like i'm just that type of person and i always keep it a honey like always what are your main priorities right now my main priorities right now is making sure my daughter is good securing a bag and working on myself to become a better me for my daughter for myself and you know just period do you want any more kids if so how many Yes, I want more kids. I want one or two more, but I'm not thinking about having no more kids until a man put a ring on my finger. If you ain't talking about putting a ring on my finger, there won't be nothing else popping out of this time, period. When are you going to start collabing with other YouTubers? I'm about to start collabing with other YouTubers next month, so make sure you guys stay tuned. I'll be collabing with y'all favorite female YouTubers. I'm not telling y'all who it is, who they are, but just stay tuned, okay? And that's all the questions that I will be answering because if I go on, it's, this thing going to be as long as the Bible. So, with that being said, if y'all want a part two, sum up in the comments. Give this video a big thumbs up. Turn on post notifications, y'all. don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I'm on the road to 200K. You feel me? Uh, with that being said, Jess Nash, I love y'all. And I'll see y'all next video. Peace out.